things that we're really excited about is just the growing number of cities that we could potentially have connectivity to Cincinnati with. Excitement is building for new potential destinations for rail enthusiasts, a community that may be bigger than you think. One thing that I'll point to is even with our current Amtrak status, which is three trains a week at three in the morning, we still have thousands of people every year who take it. Um, and I know that that is a major pushback for me in terms of taking it is the fact that it's here only at three in the morning, but people still do it. Mitch Radakovich with All Aboard Ohio is all aboard a new proposal from the Federal Railroad Administration, which would add two new long distance Amtrak routes, one from Detroit to New Orleans, the other from New York to Dallas, both with stops in Cincinnati. Looking at other states uh, where there's been a lot of success, like Michigan, and like North Carolina and Virginia, where they started in a situation similar to what we have here in Ohio right now. And now they've got four, five, six trains a day. And it's because there's the demand that keeps growing for it. While the proposed new routes are still in the FRA's study phase and would require mostly federal funding, Rodakovich says he's optimistic about the future of additional rail service through our area. We've been encouraged by seeing just how broad the support is for, for these kind of projects. And quite honestly, the Department of Transportation and the Federal Railroad Administration both have also been impressed, especially nationwide. Now, this proposal is in addition to another study that's already underway, exploring the idea of an Amtrak route connecting Cincinnati, Dayton, Columbus and Cleveland. You can always get local stories right here on YouTube, but go ahead and hit that subscribe button to get notifications to stay in the know.